hi everyone welcome back to another vlog maybe um we're up in dublin for the weekend for two nights um keelan has a powerlifting competition so we said that we'd make the most of it and like book two nights and make it like a little staycation as well this is actually our second day we came up yesterday and i just completely forgot to vlog like i'm just so out of the loop of it but literally all we did yesterday was shop we got up and we shopped all day <laughs> that's literally it and it was lash and raining so i think even if i did remember i wouldn't have vlogged um but yeah we just went around the shops and then got back to the hotel got ready and went out i met my friend for dinner my friend and her boyfriend and like that was it really because keelan couldn't drink or anything so we um didn't stay out late we we're home by like half nine i think maybe um and then yeah we were here very early so he's gone on in like ages ago and i was just doing my makeup in the car and he's going to come and get me when he's ready but yeah i'm really excited there's like it's meant to be very cool so i'll put up film what i can and that's it i don't know what we're doing for the rest of the day i have no idea what we're doing so i'm going to remember to bring these with me today hopefully fingers crossed um but yeah, I'm just going to go for now and I'm sure you'll see what I'll get up to. Bye. to Dundrum to do some more shopping so I'll bring these with me today we just checked it out and then we're gonna go home later on <sighs> so surprised I'm not dying to be honest oh that's my stuff in here oh hello <laughs> Just home from our weekend um, we got home there literally about an hour ago maybe went and did our food shop which was actually a torture to do like after a long drive but we did it we got unpacked and um, everyone packed everything i put a wash on i feel so productive um so i thought that i would end the vlog just showing you the few bits that i got literally few bits um there wasn't really that much in the shops which i'm so surprised at because i feel like dublin's always good for shopping but yeah there wasn't really that much i find that like most of the clothes in the shops were like brown and beige and cream and i don't really wear those colors like i wear like colorful colors like pink and yellow and blue um and it was all like you know like the pinterest like they were gorgeous clothes but just not my style like you know like the pinterest board that you picture with like browns and creams and like really gorgeous things but just not my style at all 
Um, so I didn't really buy that much to be honest. Um, and it was so hectic up there, but anyways, I'm just gonna show you what I got now. So I'm gonna start with Bershka. Um, yeah, let's start with Bershka. So I got this top, which I think is so cool. It's just like an oversized, so it's just like an oversized white t-shirt with this like cool design on it. And I just have it on with pink cycling shorts. And yeah, I just think it's so cool. Um, I think it was literally like 15 year maybe. Um, it's very cozy. Next thing I got brushed out was these shorts. They're just like the cool like material shorts. These were on sale for 7.80, which is like ridiculous. They're so thick and lovely. Um, so yeah, they're just like them kind of like jersey shorts. And I got them oversized and they're very cool too. Next, I got this cute little blue top. It was also on sale. So it's just like a blue tee and it has like um, this at the bottom of it. It's actually like wired. Um, but it has just this and then like a tie so that obviously goes like around your body or whatever and um, yeah it was just like a little t-shirt this was 7.80 so i mean yeah literally you could wear that with anything and i just think it's cute i didn't even apologize for my scaldy makeup you know like from wearing the masks all day ignore um then i got this top so it's sever print um little t-shirt and then the back has like the little cut out with a tie which i just think is so fab like it kind of like does it up from like a normal t-shirt to like a fancy going out on i don't know <laughs> anyways i just think it's very cute so yeah and then the last thing i got in Bershka is probably my favorite thing that i got and probably controversial i don't know because they're all in at the minute and i think either love them or hate them but little slides and I'm gonna put these on and show you because they're just that cute but the only thing I can say is they're so strange I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it on the camera oh my god it's still focus oh you really can't see it but can you see that this shoe is like wider like I don't know if you can see that but pretty much uh this shoe is like wider oh my god no it's the other way around Sorry, this shoe is wider. <laughs> you can't even see, so I don't know why I'm describing it. But pretty much one shoe is wider and it like squishes my foot, but the other shoe fits perfectly. Like it's, if you look at it, you can like visibly see that one is like wider than the other. Um, and I, it is a little bit uncomfortable. Like I tried to bring them back to exchange. See, so could I get one like the same width? And I went to a different brush guy, I went out to the one in Dundrum and they didn't even sell these shoes. So. I'm just gonna make do with their plastic. I feel like I could probably like melt it a little bit with a hairdryer and just like widen it. Like it's not really that uncomfortable, but you know, I can just feel it. But I'm not sure reason. Okay, look away now if you hate toes. That's literally how cute. So moving on now to pennies. Usually I wouldn't really be that bothered by pennies, but I needed to go in because I wanted to get a lip liner. Wait till here. So I forgot my lip liner in Galway. So I went purposely into pennies to get lip liner for my night out. Got it, and I lost it on the night out. So I went the whole weekend with no lip liner, pretty much. Um, and I, that's why I went into Pennies. But anyways, I got that lip liner. I got these sunglasses, which I think are kind of cool. Oh, I suppose I'll take these off. Yeah, I think they're very cool. And I break every pair of sunglasses I own, so I just needed to get some. Then I got this little purse. It's just like one of those like little thin ones um, just to have like your cards and stuff in. Um, I don't have one of these and I just seen it and it's pink and it's cute. So I um, actually use this all weekend. Very, very handy. Like especially because I only, like I never bring cash. So like just to have like your cards and ID or whatever in it. So handy. Lastly, I picked up this little yellow set. So it's just like a yellow bralette. Um, and then matching underwear and yeah that was six euro then i went in to lush i got myself a bath bomb which i used in the hotel it was so nice um so i can't show you that but it was pink with a little flower in it and then i picked up a face mask so i got the rosy cheeks so i got the rosy cheeks that's just what it looks like and it is Turkish rose oil and rose petal infusion. <laughs> infusion, soothe and balance faces that seek a 
softer touch while rose clay cleanses to leave you feeling as fresh as a bud <laughs> um i've actually used this already in the hotel when i had my bath and i love it it's so nice and it smells class and then this was definitely an impulse buy at the till you know when there's like little things like sitting at the till and i don't know like last minute i just grabbed it and i was like yeah i'll get this too um but i'm kind of glad i did so it's a little i've open these but they are cucumber ipads and they're like reusable um, and they're made as well from seaweed i think she said yeah seaweed and cucumber um and they're these little i'll just show you now pretty much this is it let it focus yeah so this is it it's like a little gel kind of seaweed and cucumber eye patch and you put them in the fridge and then just put them on your eye for relaxation i have used these and they're so nice um so yeah that was an impulse buy but they were like four euro and they're reusable so i'm not complaining either and i love like obviously how lush is all like natural ingredients and things so yeah that's and um, that's actually it what i got in lush um then finally we went to brown thomas and i picked up a couple of things which is the most exciting part. Um, I haven't bought makeup for myself in literally well over a year, I'd say. Yeah, literally well over a year. Um, so I went a bit crazy. Well, not really that crazy, but. So I picked up the NARS Sheer Glow Foundation and I have been wearing this over the weekend. Um, I got it in this shade. Stromboli, she said that's like the most popular um, like tan foundation you know like when people are wearing their tan which that's what i wanted and um, so that's it like it's just so cool so bougie um, and i love it i actually do it's really nice to go on wear as well and the color is perfect with my tan to be honest then she also gave me a sample of their climax extreme mascara and like this is a pretty decent sized mascara like there's actually loads in it like you need to wipe it off um, the side of the bottle whenever you're using it or else there's too much on the brush so that'll probably last me ages i don't actually wear mascara that often either so delighted with that then i went to mac and i got the mineralize skin finish bronzer <laughs> um and i got this in give me sun i mean if you know you know this was like such a big statement in your makeup bag years ago but i love it it's so good um and i've also been using that over the weekend i love it too um for anyone wondering give me some is a good shade as well for if you're wearing tan i'm sorry as well and then finally i'm wearing thomas i picked up the olaplex oil bonding oil so this is it and i'm actually gonna have a shower now so i'm so wasn't to my hair um but yeah, I've always wanted to try that. I do use a hair oil, literally. I could not have a shower without using a hair oil. Um, but it's just a L'Oreal one, and I'm finding it a little bit like heavy for my hair at the minute. Um, yeah, I think it just, I, feel, I don't know, it just feels a little bit heavy. So I wanted to try something new, and that looks actually quite nice because it's more liquidy, where the one I have is kind of more sticky. I don't know how to describe it. But yeah, that's literally everything that I bought. As I said, it wasn't that much, even though I still spent a bomb. I did have on my list to get the Charlotte Tilbury, what is it called? I think they're like, you know, they're like liquid blushes, like kind of highlighters. I can't think of what they're called, like glow sticks or something. Um, and I wanted to get the blush color, I think it's called Peachgasm. And I went to three different shops, yeah, three different shops. To get it and they're sold out everywhere they said literally everywhere in dublin is sold out that i'm better off just getting it online and um, so i would have got that too and i probably will order it online i also wanted to get um a pair of doc martin sandals and they were sold out everywhere i went to three different shops i think it was three as well three different shops um and they only had them in size three in every shop um so I might order them online as well, but they were two like main things that I wanted to get when I was in Dublin and then I couldn't obviously because they're so popular. Um, but yeah, that's literally it. I, I think, 
but I can't even remember really what I filmed over the weekend. Um, I know I didn't film Saturday, which I'm a bit annoyed about, but to be honest, we just did all this shopping and it was raining outside. And we did go to this place for toasties. It was called Meltdown. If you follow me on my Instagram, which will be in the link below, um, you would have seen it. It was like a toastie with mac and cheese in it. Ideal, it was so, so good, so nice. Um, but that was it. We literally just shopped, went back to the hotel room, got ready, got ready straight away, and then went for dinner with my friend and her boyfriend, and then came home because Keelan had to be up early for his competition. And then I think I filmed from there on, maybe? I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, we're just home now. I'm gonna go make all my lunches for the week. I'm back to work tomorrow, and that's it. <laughs> My fun weekend is over, um, but I'm gonna make the most of it tonight for sure. We're gonna make a nice dinner and chill out, watch Love Island. Um, yeah, I hope you've made it through this far of the vlog. If you did, I hope you enjoyed, and that's it. I will see you in the next one. Bye.